Welcome to Momentum Software Solutions. This is a short demonstration on Momentum Job Cost Advantage. Job Cost Advantage provides users with enhanced features not available in standard EXO job costing. To launch Job Cost Advantage, open a job and hover over the number 1 button. It displays the words Momentum Job Cost Advantage. Clicking on it will open the main Job Cost Advantage screen. This screen automatically populates with the job that the application was launched from. This main screen lists the various features of Job Cost Advantage. Hovering over one of these features will provide more information on the right hand side of the screen. We will now go through each of the functions available. Add Multiple Kits is designed for businesses that use kits extensively in jobs and quoting. The utility automatically adds kits to the Quote tab of a job, where the kit is linked to a stock item, that is, the output item of the kit. In this example, the kit is Car Care 03. It has various component items. Car Care 01 is a subassembly of the kit. The kit must be linked to an output item, in this case Car Care 03. In the Quote tab of the job, enter the output item, not the kit. This enables the quantity or price to be changed during the quoting process. After the quote is won and the job will proceed, click on Add Multiple Kits in Job Cost Advantage. Save and exit the job and reopen. The kits are now added to the Quote tab, including the subassembly Car Care 01. Auto Create POs will automatically create purchase orders for all quote lines where stock is needed. For example, in this job, if we add stock item radio cassette, we can see that there is zero in stock. Save the job, and in Job Cost Advantage, click on Auto Create POs. If we go back to the job and refresh in the Purchases screen, we can see that a purchase order has been created for the item. Common Phrases allows you to set up a hierarchical list of common phrases. Comments or groups of comments can be added by right-clicking and selecting Add Comment or Add Group. Comments can be copied to the clipboard, which allows you to paste them within narratives, descriptions, or private notes in the jobs as desired. Delete Quote Lines allows you to delete quote lines with zero quantities. For example, in this job, Oval Chrome Air Filter has a zero quantity line. Clicking on Delete Quote Lines in Job Cost Advantage, this line appears here. Only lines with the status Q are shown here and can be deleted. Select the line and click on Delete Selected. This line will now be removed from the Quote tab. Fix Line Numbers is used to resequence line numbers in the Quote tab. This is useful where lines have been copied from one quote to another using the Copy button in the Quote tab and the line numbers are out of sequence or duplicated. This utility will fix this. For example, in this job, some of the line numbers are duplicated as they were copied from the Quote tab of another job. Clicking on Fix Line Numbers in Job Cost Advantage and reopening the job, 
we can see that these line numbers have now been fixed. Resource allocation allows you to allocate resources to a job based on certain criteria. The current job with its start and end dates appears. Selecting certain criteria will populate the bottom half of the screen with resources that match this criteria. For example, under Skills, clicking on Driver's License, Private Car, Full will bring up these two resources. These can then be assigned to the job by clicking on the checkbox under Selected and clicking on Assign. Opening resource allocations in the job, we can see that these two resources have been allocated to the job. Transfer cost timesheet lines to another job allows you to move multiple transaction lines between jobs. In standard job costing, it only allows one line at a time to be moved. Clicking on the button, it launches the utility to transfer job lines. Select the target job in the To field. Check the lines that you wish to move and click on OK. The lines will now be moved from the original job to the new job. Update Kit Quantity allows you to change the quantities for kits that have been added to the Quote tab of a job. In standard job costing, the quantity of a kit cannot be changed once it is saved. The user would need to remove it and re-add it. Clicking on Update Kit Quantity displays the existing kits with their current quantities. In this job, we can see that there is one of Car Care 01. We can change the quantity to two, for example. If we close and reopen the job, we can see that the quantity has now changed to two. Delivery Docket allows for the creation of a delivery docket independently of what has been invoiced in the job. Clicking on New creates a new docket and pre-populates the fields in relation to the job and the customer. Lines can be inserted in the bottom half of the screen. For example, we want to create a delivery docket for supplying one of Airful 01. Enter the quantity, the product and the description. The product does not have to be a specific stock code. Click on Save to save the document. The document can be selected from the drop-down list at the top of the screen and printed. Duplicate Job allows you to create a duplicate of the current job. Items to be copied can be selected using the checkboxes. Tick Show Job After Copy to open the new job once it is created. After selecting the relevant checkboxes, click on OK. The new job is created and automatically opened. We can see that it has copied across all the selected items. Under the Settings tab, there is a button called Enable Job Cost Purchase Order Consolidation. When ticked, this will create a checkbox called Consolidation on your Job Costing Purchase Order screen. When saving a purchase order, if there are multiple occurrences of the same items, in other words, lines with the same stock code, description and price, these will be replaced with a single line with the quantity being the sum of the lines. For example, in this job, we will create a purchase order and tick the consolidation checkbox. We will add one of Airfill 05 and one of Airfill 01. Saving the purchase order, these lines appear on the job. Going back to the purchase order at a later stage, 
we might add another airfoil 05. Save and exit. We can now see that these two lines for airfoil 05 have been consolidated into one line. Thank you for watching this short demonstration on Momentum Job Cost Advantage.